Oh, that's so pretty. That's awesome. Good work. This hands-on training class learned how to mimic Mother Nature using epoxy. The Burl Hunter puts on a three-day hands-on class teaching how to use epoxy to create custom surfaces. You can renew and refinish old countertops, tabletops, desktops, and more. This class learned the tips and tricks to creating epoxy magic. Visit us anytime, stay tuned, and enjoy the video. I think we should try it, man. Remember, when you subscribe to our channel, click on the red subscribe button and be sure to ring the bell so you get notified every time we have a new video. Thanks again. These projects started with three quarter inch painted MDF. You know what blue pearl granite looks like? This is a high end look, man. I think we should try it. Alcohol and metallic powders make great undertones. You're gonna be high up. You don't want to be close. You want blotches. Creating realistic looking granite is simple. Here we're doing undertones with alcohol and metallic mixture. After that's complete, we'll mix up our two part stone coat countertop epoxy. We use a 1 8 inch square notch trial to spread the material and then we'll simply mist it with black spray paint. By fracturing that spray paint with the alcohol, it creates reactions that give you realism. The depth is incredible. It was awesome seeing how the class chose their own colors to customize this look to their own taste. It's limitless the colors that you can create by simply mixing and matching metallics. That's awesome. Good work. Right. Tools and techniques take the guesswork out of creating a custom do-it-yourself surface. This class had a blast learning those techniques. Check out some of the things they created. You guys, dude, <laughs> these two are sick. Good job. Dang. Whatever you use, I would also use white and black. It really gives a good contrast. Greg the Burl Hunter and his team are amazing instructors. Advanced color technique. This class was jam-packed full of different techniques that the class learned hands-on. Stone Coat Countertop Epoxy is user-friendly. There's a long open working time, so the class didn't need to be in a rush. It's do-it-yourself friendly, and there's no noxious smell because it's zero VOC. The durability is found in our heat resistance, our scratch resistance, our UV resistance. This is designed for countertops and places that you need to refinish and renew. You can mimic what you imagine. Like, how much would that slab cost? The Burl Hunter Shop is a great resource for custom burls and wood elements. You see how stressed out Mitch isn't? <laughs> and that's the whole point. You guys got to have fun with it. And one thing that you guys did with this is we weren't trying to do any specific effect. You let the material do its thing and it knows how to do its thing better than we do. Take the chore out of a dirty pour. Our epoxy products are great for do-it-yourselfers, artists, floor contractors, and many other applications. Woodworkers love creating river tables and custom finishes. This is a practical and fun technique using cellophane to create movement. By introducing random spots of clear epoxy over completed effects creates additional depth, realism, interest, and takes your project to the next level. You could replicate very high-end stone. We had a house that we were flipping, yeah. and it was a very small house, and um, it was about 1,100 square feet, just under 1,100 square feet, and it was very boxy in the kitchen and living room area, so we decided we needed to do something to sell this house because it was just very dark and dingy. Uh -huh. So we took out the uh, upper cabinets and opened it up to the living room, uh -huh. and then we used stone coat all over the countertops that were there, the little island that 
that jetted out and um, and put in brand new appliances, and it's what sold the house. It opened it up. It, it the light that that um, came off of the countertop just made everything light and bright and airy, and it just totally changed the look of the house. And so because of that, when houses in the area were going for two twenty nine, two forty nine a square foot, we got a three hundred dollars a square foot for an eleven hundred square foot house. Yeah, wow. So yeah, we we did really really well in this house because of this, and the cost of it was inexpensive. And yeah. I did it myself. Visit StoneCoatCountertops.com to see all the products used in this video.